Factory Track semifinals game number one is underway right here between Mercury Swirl and Freezing H2O. First ever playoff appearance for both of these marbles, and one of them will make it to the Back to Track Championship game. If one of these marbles ends up winning the Back to Track Championship, they make the SCS. Now, Mercury Swirl, he has to win the Back to Track Championship to make it. Freezing H2O, he'll need to win Back to Track this year. But he can still make it with a silver medal if Desert Island doesn't win a medal in this semifinals. So there are some things to note right there. But very excited for this matchup right here. Mercury Swirl versus Freezing H2O. The winner will advance to the back to track championship game. Let's see which marble can do it. All right, let's begin semifinals game number one right now. We roll a four on the dice roll. So balance jump, timed race, and then maze race will be the order for our first semifinals game right here. All right, so Mercury Swirl will kick us off right here, and he'll get to the 30 to start the balance jump. Not a bad start for Mercury Swirl, a warm-up attempt. But anyway, Freezing H2O will go up for his first try. It will only be 10, so two points for Mercury Swirl to start this one. Pretty good start for him, 2 to nothing. And now the second try. Freezing H2O going first here on the second. And he will get to the 20, so better than his first. Let's see how Mercury Swirl responds to that. Has a chance to build his lead a little bit more if he gets a really good second try and he gets a full 50. Three more points for Mercury Swirl. And that'll jump him up to the 5 to nothing lead to start this game. Move on to the timed race. Mercury Swirl, smooth first try, 33. Freezing H2O needs a really good first try to stay alive in this one. This is a slow one. Mercury Swirl's going to take a huge lead, 39. Three more points for Mercury Swirl. And now it's 8 to nothing. Freezing H2O not giving up. 32, really good second try right there. Mercury Swirl needs a 34 or better to mathematically clinch the win in this one. What is this going to be? 34, exactly. Mercury Swirl will only give one point to Freezing H2O right there. And Mercury Swirl has mathematically clinched the back-to-track championship game this year. So Mercury Swirl playing tomorrow. He is confirmed to win a medal. He'll either win gold or silver. Freezing H2O trying to win bronze. He will also play tomorrow. But in the third place game, Freezing H2O has no shot to make the season championship series. Mercury Swirl, he has to win tomorrow to make it. Now we're just going to play out this maze race. It doesn't matter who wins the maze race. We are on to the fifth point right now. Let's just see if Freezing H2O can at least get some more points to end this game off. And he will do that. The game will end at 8-3 to three, and we will see Mercury Swirl play tomorrow in the fourth annual back to track championship game for a chance to make the season championship series his opponent will either be swaggy green cricket or desert island that will be our second semifinals matchup for this back to track tournament it's been a great tournament for mercury swirl after he beat blue wombat back in round three you just knew that mercury swirl was not a joke in this back to track tournament and he'll be in the final game of the tournament but anyway thank you very much for watching this i will see y'all later for the semifinals to close with swag you can cricket versus desert island